Hello, Bo, and hello, everyone else. Yes, Gasp, Rocco is now officially an emote. So, uh, thank you again, Bo. It, I don't know why that took so long. I waited almost an entire week for Rocco to get through. And, uh, it was just this morning that I got the email where Twitch was like, yeah, we can, you can have a rock with googly eyes. Maybe that'll be okay. Howdy gamers indeed. Um, oh boy. Um, so hands up. Who doesn't know about Daikatana? Because Daikatana is a very spe- Oh boy. Okay. So we have to do a quick little history lesson. So way back in the year that I was born, 1994, id Software, a couple of just just a couple of guys being dudes, made this cool game called Doom. One of those guys who was just being dudes also may or may not have um, actually possibly sold his soul to the devil to gain programming powers. That was John Carmack. Um, he also invented modern VR, 3D video games. 2.5D video games, Shadows in video games, and uh, basically all modern video game tech comes from him. Now, there was another John on the team, John Romero, and he did a lot of the, uh, the, the actual game development part. And together, they made Doom, which you guys know Doom, and then they made Quake. I'm guessing you guys know Quake. And then he got a big head. And he left id to make his own game studio and his own game, which is a weeaboo dream, as far as I understand. I have never played it myself, but Dai Katana is um horrible, first off. And second off, it's pure anime. You got a sword. You got guns. You've got weird sort of neo-noir bullshit going on. The point is, John Romero was used to having a literal tech wizard make his games. So when he went to make Dai Katana and he didn't, he didn't realize how bad it was going to be. And on top of that, it came with probably the best ad campaign of all time. 
in which real actual magazines published a big red box that said, John Romero is about to make you his bitch. And then he destroyed his own name in the gaming industry. And now I'm going to destroy my soul. Also, we keep Pride Shop at the top. Doesn't matter that we're not playing with rolls. Oh, Jesus, that's loud. Okay. We're going to turn sound effects down. We're going to turn music down. We're going to turn cinematic volume down. I, hey! John Romero did promise to make us his bitch, so, you know. Yeah, yeah, that's, uh... Okay, let's just... Oh my god. Why? We're just gonna turn. There we go. Okay. That should be better. Yeah. Okay. Hopefully that's better. Video, we can't mess with any of this. Wait, what's intensity? Well, I don't know what that just did, but I hope it's good. Okay. Also, please do quote your favorite Dai Katana story from an interview with someone who worked on it. I feel like we'll actually get through part of the game if I select Ronin. But the idiot in me wants to select Shogun, and thankfully, the idiot's in charge. Why does it tick when it loads? Pride Chop stays through the whole month of Pride. Oh my god. His head looks like a potato that someone tried to carve into a head. Oh, hold on. There's a voice. I turned it down too much. Pardon the interruption, Miyamoto-san. There is a visitor waiting outside, refuses to identify himself, will only speak to the proprietor of the school. Also, Tanaka-san left a message earlier. Fuck, I should have stayed in bed. Let me guess, Miho, it's my landlord at the door, right? Like I said, the visitor would not give his name. I, I love how you can just, hold on. Will this skip the cutscene? Fuck that, skip the cutscene. Well, who needs the story of Dai Katana? Am I right? It's Dai Katana. <laughs> I love how they fucking drop in. How many did we lose? Only four this time. Looks like my luck's holding out. Too bad for you. Damn. <laughs> I can't imagine the voice acting is very stellar. Actually, I take that back. I can imagine it is. Oh, well, we killed him. Okay, I need to read Bo's comment. This was talking about how they had a very rough problem with employee turnover because of course it did, and the best summation of that problem was a constantly rotating cast of new employees is in the pronunciation of the main character's name. During a meeting, I explained to John I was working on the endgame cinematic with Kage. With Kage, I pronounced it as Cage. Romero giggled. Who? What? What are you working on? I said it again. Now everyone was laughing at me. Romero, who? Say it again? Me. Um, Cage? Romero, no, dude. It's pronounced Kage. <laughs> me. Um, well, you better check the voiceover recordings because it's Cage. <laughs> and suddenly Romero's face turned white. Half the audio in the game had his name pronounced wrong and it was too late to fix. Oh my god, we have to. Okay, I'm guessing that's cinematic. Okay. I'm gonna. No, that's still too loud. Fuck it, no voices. Resume. Oh. Oh. 
Wow. Oh. Oh, this feels like shit. Oh. Oh, my God. Oh, I really can't describe this to you guys. It's hard to... It, oh, my jump is so tiny. It, it feels like I'm on grease. It feels like someone greased up my mouse pad and it's not catching everything that it's supposed to. Oh, fuck. That's great. Why is it so slippery? Everything is slippery. Oh, I'm gonna be sick playing this. Where do I even go? Um, try punching this. Oh, that worked. Why am I still punch? Oh my god. Oh, no okay. So I'm gonna show you guys something that I just uh, I just discovered. It registers every click, even if it doesn't go through. So I'm gonna click three times really fast in a row. It just, like if I click repeatedly and then I stop, it still does the punches that I didn't, oh no. Where do I even go? Do I go in the sludge? Is it slime time? Why? 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 Frogs? Frogs? Where is my help? I can't tell if I'm dying right now or not. Why? Who made the frogs evil? Huh? Oh. I'm not even gonna shoot that. I don't think I need to. Yeah, where's the katana? I was promised to die katana. Oh. I'm never gonna get used to this. This literally feels like if someone said, Hey, what if you make the quake engine but bad? Oh, it is so hard to make anything. Oh. Pride chop his chat's health. If we die, it turns to. Ah! 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 Oh, I really want to go in the hole, but I know I shouldn't go in the hole, but I really want to go in the slime hole. But I shouldn't go in the slime hole. I'm gonna go in the slime hole. I'm lost. Oh, I found a secret. What? Berserker? Oh. I'll take that. Jesus, I just lost the game. Like the screen. Oh. Hold on. Let me try and. Let me see if this works. Why don't I have health? Do I need to turn the intensity down? Oh, whoa. That made it even worse. Atmospheric, though, that's nice. Stop. I have no idea what I just did. Why can't I see my hell? Always run. Let's do that. We're going to need auto-targeting. 
Status bar vis... Wait a minute, is all this... No? What am I doing wrong? What am I doing wrong? Okay, I'm gonna try changing the resolution. Oh, hey, Carrie! You joined for garbage! I still don't have a health bar. Oh, screen size! Oh, ooh, ooh, hold on, that may do it. Nope. Yeah, let me try turning down screen size. That's literally all I can imagine is because the screen size was at 120. No, I still don't have a health bar. What the fuck is this? Configuration file. Romero? Oh god, that's so loud! Oh god! Oh! Oh! Oh god! John! Why? Why John Romero? Why? Oh, God. <laughs> I don't even know what my goal is. I don't know what this story is. I skipped half of it. I have no idea what's going on. Turn on shadows, we'll turn on shiny weapons. I guess we just don't get... Maybe we don't get the health on the highest le- Okay, let me try medium difficulty. Maybe medium difficulty will actually give me knowledge of what's happening. Oh, there we go. Oh, why? I have good news and I have bad news. Good news. I can now see um, my stats. Bad news. Controls now inverted. Why? John Romero. Why? Oh my god! John Romero had it set to arrow keys! I have to- Oh my god! Default. There we go. Okay, much better. This is... This isn't just infuriating. This is confusing? I... Definitely not loading in some skins. Yeah, you know, I am sure feeling like John Romero's pick right now. So he was successful in that. Wait. Do I start with all the weapons? Did I start with all the weapons unlocked because I selected Romero mode? <laughs> oh my god, I have all the weapons! Except, of course, me got Daikatan. Ow. They spent forever on this. This came out, like, well after Half-Life. 
Imagine playing Half-Life and then playing this. Okay, here we go. The plot. In an undisclosed time in the 16th century in feudal Japan, Usagi Miyamoto was born and raised by his father, swordsmith and weapons forger, Ishiro Miyamoto. The Ebiharas and Miyamotos are engaged in clan wars, and the Miyamoto's oppressive regime is crumbling. Osaka Mishima hires Usagi Miyamoto to create the ultimate weapon for him, the Dai Katana. You wouldn't download a good game. Okay. Okay, we actually gotta... We gotta actually... There we go. Let's actually play the video game. Yeah, we gotta... Wait, there was something over there last time. Born by his father, Trans Swordsmith. Anything with that? Okay, we learned not to use that. Oh, wow! The shotgun just keeps firing until it's out. Oh my god. Oh, oh no. Oh, this is awful. You can't change weapons while reloading. Wait, there's a poisoning system? Why did you put stats in this game? Oh my god, I just saw I just saw the word level. There's leveling in this. Yeah, I can... Oh, my God. Yeah, I keep forgetting. Hold on. Let me... Holy shit, this is awful. Okay. Hopefully, this will be better. I like that your enemies so far are all creatures you'd find in Animal Crossing. That's the real reason John Romero created this. His pure hatred of Animal Crossing. Oh, is that a secret? Well, I th I've been protected by the chromatic armor. I'm gonna turn it down a little bit more. Okay. Let's try that. The Daikatana is the only weapon that can kill Tom Nook. This game is like someone dumped an entire box of obnoxious cartoon sound effects down a flight of stairs. I'm just gonna... You're all just gonna sit at, like, six. There we go. Oh wait, yeah, I've already, I was already, I've already been down there. Okay. Oh shit. Oh, is that a rocket launcher? That's pretty cool. What the fuck was that? What? What killed me? What? Are you fucking kidding me? Oh my god. All right, no, we're we're going back to we're we're going back to 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 easy. No. This fucking sucks. We haven't even gotten to the bad part yet. This isn't the bad part. Now I don't have all the weapons anymore. What happened? I don't give a shit. So happy that Pork Chop has now become the face of G 
janky ass video games. No, I don't think, I don't know what happened. I don't think I was supposed to have those weapons. I, th I think those were given. I got a crystal. Can I pluck, can I pluck these berries? Why are the berries sparking when I punch them? It doesn't happen. Oh, okay, it does happen when I punch a wall. I was going to say. Oh, the, like, in all ways describable, this game feels greasy. The berries aren't done charging. Oh, God. I can hear them, but there you are, you fucker. Okay, yeah. This, yeah, I should really put air quotes around the word game, shouldn't I? Let me try punching the frog. That actually worked. I was going to say, I can hear something, but I couldn't see what was coming after me. Let me, hold on. Yeah, let's save. Save game, and while we're at it, let's see if there's a quick save. Oh, right, the sidekicks. Okay, F2. F2 is our best friend. Well, we're getting a little further each time now. Do I have a robot armor? Is that supposed to be a glove? You know what? I don't care. I don't want to know world lore in Daikatana, actually. Those do nothing. Oh my god. Does it do the ticking every time I hit a loading screen? Oh, they picked the worst sound for this too, because it is like, I am wearing very nice headphones and it feels like the, oh fuck, ah, 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 ah. Oh wait, oh, let me try shooting the power. Ow. Anyways. It feels like there's a mosquito in my ear. Oh boy, there's a little heartbeat when I'm dying. Okay, well, you know, now it's... It's getting a little better now. Nope, never mind. I can hear the mosquitoes again. I don't like that it's making me kill frogs. Like out of every possible thing you could have made mechanical and forced me to slaughter. Why frogs? Why does the whole screen shake? It's not that large of an explosion. This is exactly what Feudal Japan was like. This is what it looked like, and that's accurate historical weaponry. Okay, I got him. Did that say save gem? Oh my god! You use currency to save?! You have to use a currency in order to save the game. John Romero, what the fuck were you doing? That's so fucking stupid. 
Where's the unlimited saves option? Where the fuck is it? Okay, yeah, because fuck, fuck that. No alt tab allowed? Oh my god. No, 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 fuck the, oh my god. This is like, this is like a vintage wine of bad video games. Because it's bad in ways that I'd never really considered before. Like, I never thought that, that's the thing. Ink ribbon style, that made sense because it was supposed to, like, be, it was supposed to be tension and, like, what the fuck are you hiding? I'll at least partially defend ink ribbon saving. Because, like, once again, that was, that made sense there. This is a first person shooter where you notoriously can die from turning down a corner too fast. <laughs> Vintage wine that's gone bad and turned into vinegar, maybe. The curdled old milk of video games. Oh boy. Whoever would have seen that coming. God, not more fucking, oh my God. Oh, nope. You don't see me, you don't see me. Hold on. Did I just read that correctly? That the pathfinding failed in all of them? And so its first reaction was to just like, tell me, I'm just gonna punch him. There's nothing satisfying about punching these bugs, which is really upsetting because you'd think that punching bugs would be satisfying, and it's really not. Oh, God! I take it back. This game is a fucking, this game is a masterpiece. This game is high art. This, this is amazing. This is an A24 film, but a video game. Can I jump up there? Uh, A24 is the guys who did, um, they, they do art house films. I suddenly can't remember a single A24 film. I need a second. I, oh yeah, the, the Vivich. That was definitely a movie that happened. I've never actually watched an A24 movie. I've only heard the memes about them. <sighs> okay, hold on. We, did it not save our options? No, it did. Wait. I thought it said that... Is there no autosave? Oh my god. Yeah, save the game. John Romero makes you his vitch. Oh yeah, they're also making uh, Marcel the Shell with the shoes on, which I can't wait to cry. I can't wait to bawl my eyes out to that. I can already tell it is going to rip out my beating heart 
and I am going to thank it. Why in the world would they introduce a turret with that short of a range of attack and a very clearly marked area to shoot? Wait, is that a robot alligator? That's actually kind of rad, not gonna lie. Did I go this way last time? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. I want to go the other way this time. I have already been that way. Yeah, so it's a cute YouTube series, and then they picked it up about Marcel the Cell with the shoes on finding his family. All right, is that a secret or just a really fucked up rock? Hold on. Let me check the controls again. What is use? Jump is space. Use and operate. Enter? Whatever. Okay, yeah, that's what I thought. Okay, that's useful. Those are all very useful. Okay. Wait, hold on. Is that... Now am I supposed to... Hold on, I'm going to try something. I'm going to... Wait, wait, wait. Nope. I'm going to be smart. I'm going to be smart. I just heard, like, Five's voice in the back of my head saying, Make sure to save... Did Donkey Kong Country 2 also use uh, currency for saving? That's the thing. Currency for saving, like, it can make sense. But in a game like this... No. I wonder if that was real Japanese, or if that was just weeaboo fake Japanese. Because I feel like John Romero would put weeb Japanese in a game. Yeah, let me try going down here, maybe? Wait, is that shooting me with a machine gun? Ah! Did the game just summon the boss and forget to actually summon it? Also, real talk. You know what this game kind of looks like at points? This looks like Donkey Kong 64, but worse. Donkey Kong 64, but they stuck it in a glow stick. Oh my god, are those seriously projectiles? How in the fuck am I supposed to... Well, it's not hurting me, so... You know what? Whatever. This looks like a Conquer level would parody it. What was that music that just played? Was that the music congratulating me for winning? Oh my god. Wait, how do I get back up now? How do I get back up? Oh, okay, there we go. What kind of evil mastermind makes robot frogs anyways? I just want to know what possessed them to use frogs. Because this is supposed to be a serious game. This is supposed to be like 
taken at face value. God fucking bees. Dr. Eggman. Is this just a, a mature Sonic the Hedgehog? That's why the controls are like a little slippery. Oh my God. We figured it out. Daikatana is just Sonic the Hedgehog 5. Honest to God, with how many... Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! What was that? Oh. It seems that control is not crouch, but also shoot. Where is it? Oh, um... Okay, so you don't know about that, do you? Wait. Can I eat the berries? I'm not crazy. I just ate that berry, right? You all saw that, right? I ate the berry. But now I can't eat the rest? This game generally makes me feel like I'm going through an episode. Oh, come on. Can I, come on. Can I get... There we go. Oh, come on. Can't wait for the mechanic where you spend 10 real life minutes in game shitting because you ate a random real life. Because you ate a random berry. Oh my god. With everything I've gone through so far, I could see it. Is this game gonna ask me to crouch jump without giving me the ability to easily crouch? Come on! Fuck! God, this sucks. And like, I know I, I know I asked for this. I know that I was banking on entertainment because it sucks, but this is just awful. Where do I go? What am I doing? Hold on, okay, let me see. So that goes up there. Okay, so I do need to go up there. How do I get up there? I keep trying to jump up here, and it's not working. Oh, hold on, let me... Yeah, if I go to the... Nope. If you go to the side, you slip off. So let me try... There we go! Is that a spider web, or a trip line. Nope. That's just a mistake. Just like the rest of this game. Man, that frog was just waiting there. He was having a good time. He was on vacation. At least that one didn't shake my entire screen. I'll thank it for that. I fell in water in every video game I have ever seen. Falling in water makes you not take damage. Oh my god, the effects on that projectile are horrid. Are you an enemy? The thing just gurgled at me. Oh. Sir? 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 Oh shit! How the fuck did you survive that? Here, let me eat some berries. I really hope the pants shitting mechanic is real. 
sir. Although that guy's just working and he didn't realize that there was a problem until I came in. Well, okay, to be fair, maybe they weren't harassing them. Maybe they're afraid of me. Hmm. What? What? Punching it doesn't do it. Oh! Okay. We have door. Is there anything else in here? Oh, there is! Boy, that is a very polygonal... Wait, hold on. Yeah, I'm going to go back because I think I just opened something previously. And I just need to go check. Oh boy, it's the wonderful old video game mechanic of going huh! every time I jump. Wait, was there something? Am I backtracking for nothing? I don't actually care about Daikatana enough. What am I doing? I don't care if I miss a secret. This sucks. This game feels like it's trying to be a ripoff of Half-Life and failing. Well, that's not working. Wait, am I shooting myself on accident? Who thought those would be fun? Oh, that's what's hitting me. I honest to God thought I was just getting the shits or something from the berries. <laughs> I was like, why am I taking damage? I mean, it makes sense. I'm going around there eating random berries that are just like growing on the sidewalk of a, a neo-industrial hellscape. By the way, I would like to point out this is the worst movement speed in water in a video game. Just standing there. Once again, I have a hard time believing that this game was not made, like, horrid on purpose. Also, hello, Connor. Oh, I'm dying. I'm forging the ultimate shit. How do I tell when I'm leveling up? Why is it playing the low health heartbeat? I had a hundred health. Not gonna lie, this looks delicious. Okay, I need to actually talk about one of the worst purchases I've made in recent memory and it's not that big of a purchase it's just kind of funny um, so when I did the half-life at at extreme speed stream uh, for one thing I would like to add um, ooh, the C4 Visigador um, I would like to add um, I am doing Half-Life 2 still. I've tested it out, and it does work. So at some point in the near future, we are getting a Half-Life 2 at extreme speed video, I think. Or streams. And I'm guessing I'm probably going to do that right after we finish with the Adventures of Pork Chop. Um, anyways, when we did that Half-Life stream, all that green ooze had me feeling a sort of way and 
that way was I want to eat something lime green. So I bought a 12 pack of lemon lime jello. Took one bite and realized, oh, this sucks. Half-Life lied to me. And um, it's just been sitting in my fridge for about two months now. Oh, okay. Uh-oh. Oh, that's how that works. Okay. Okay, now that it's on easy, it's not as bad. Stop that. Go away. I would love to see Porkchop and Vampire the Masquerade. Okay, that is the one crossover I am willing for Porkchop. I've never actually played Vampire the Masquerade. Maybe that game will make me hate him less. I hate that it adds sound effects to a loading screen. It can't actually be tang taking this long to load, right? Oh my god. What? I just did a complete loop. Oh. Thanks. I have no idea where I'm going, what I'm doing, etc., etc. I... Hey, wait, hold on. I haven't been here. What? what? Oh, what? Oh. Okay. Wow, we're already on to our sewer system. firepower to blast through that gate. I wonder if I can. Holy shit, a ghost! Obi-Wan Kenobi. I love your TV show on Disney+. Uh, hold on. Is that actually... Is that actually supposed to be a ghost? Oh, okay. Me too, buddy. Whoa, what was that all about? Um. Can I please get some enemies? There, I just want an enemy that's not that. I gotta know that th there hasn't been magic in this so far. I thought this was like a sci-fi game. Damn, guys, you really busting it down white boy style. What did I do? Did I do something horrible that I did? Oh. Star Wars is not sci-fi. It's science fantasy. Thank you very much. Can I open this? Seriously, what did I do that these guys are so afraid of me? Hello? <laughs> He's, they're really not trying very hard to run from me. This is a really poorly hidden secret, but I'll take it. Oh shit, what? Um... Uh, uh, oh my god, John Romero, you motherfucker. I mean, to be fair, that was a very John Romero move. I can see, I can see the Romero-isms. Oh 
Also, replacing the phi with fantasy when the phi is short for fiction implies the difference is that science fantasy is real. It is. Oh, I should probably hop back down. For, yeah, because otherwise that would... Nope. Nope. I was fine as, as it was. Oh, that's probably a secret back there. Hold on. Let me... Yeah, that's a that's definitely a secret. That's a That's a classic secret right there. Why else would an elevator be shaped like this? Oh fuck. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Ah, oh, oh, oh. Alright, I gotta figure out what ducking is. Um Crouch is of course it's C. There we go. <laughs> Undying voice, Star Wars is real, right? <laughs> All right, that's the next confusing decision they made. Why, why is every single attack, or why, I guess, why is your starting weapon a bounce weapon. That feels like... That feels like a mistake they shouldn't had to have made. You know? I'm trying really hard not to kill any of these workers, and they're making it very hard to not kill them. Okay, let me try the explosive. Whoa. It... It only sets off if I'm next to it. Why would you do that? Are there any consequences to killing the workers? Yeah, I would feel bad. They're just working, man. Also, do you guys also hear the sound that he makes when I try to activate something? Well, let me... I thought that was my own fart notification for getting a sub, and I was like, oh boy, and then I realized, no, they just thought it would be a good idea to make him take a shit every time he- What is hitting me? Ow! Hold on. Why can't I alt-tab out? Oh, there we go. This game is stupid. <laughs> it's because I ate the berries. You know what? I could honestly see John Romero making that like something that happens in one of his games. Also, is this? That is hazardous for work environments. That can't be good for you. <laughs> He's doo-dooing all over the place. <laughs> Fucking move, guys. Hold on. I wonder if I can ferry them all on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I'm going to try and ferry them onto there. Oh, run from me. Oh, I'm big and scary. Ah, oh, run from me. Ah, oh, you should go onto the elevator and take a quick dip in the radioactive piss. Ah. Oh. It's pain in stereo. Please stop. What did that open, by the way? I wasn't paying attention. Also, plot twist, your OSHA inspecting this building. Shut up!
God, you guys have no idea how terrified I am knowing that the worst part comes soon. Or, like, it's not at maximum bad yet. Because I've been informed of the height of how bad it gets. But then again, I only know about how bad it gets on one of the versions. Maybe it doesn't get as bad on the PC version? Maybe? I hope? Well, time to wait for this! Great! Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, he's a good little elevator. Come on, you could do Oh, there we go. My puppy just sat up and stared at me because I used that voice and she thought I was talking about, uh, talking about her. I feel bad. Maybe it doesn't get as bad. Man, that's a cry for help if I've ever heard one. It is. Really? Wait a minute. Hold on. When it returns, it does... Oh, wait. It does follow the track. Okay. I'll get... No, it doesn't. It doesn't follow its own track. Uh, how's the puppy day? She's very sad because I wouldn't give her some of my Jimmy John sandwich. Can I slip through here? Can I just, you know... Can I just sort of slip and slide? Just... Nope. Okay. Please stop running. Oh, okay. That closed it. I, it was it was a Thai chili wrap. It would have been bad for her. She would have gotten the turbo shits, and she already gets the shits. Whoa, okay. You're large. Whoa, okay. You are also large. You know, I I actually felt a glimmer of joy there. Also, did I give her a treat? Buddy, when I pulled up to that Jimmy John's, I asked them for two whole strips of bacon. And Duchess got to eat them out of uh, some poor minimum wage worker's hand. And they both had a great time. I hope that uncancels me. secret? Nope. I feel like I shouldn't jump down there, but I see a ladder. But there's also very large poop nuggets falling from there. When did a little giant falling shit ever hurt anyone? Am I right? Wait, can I swim up this? Is this it? That's it? That sucks. Uncancel, but you're on thin fucking ice unless you write your will so that your riches go to only your dog so we can have rich dog hijinks. Look, she already gets everything that I make. That would change nothing. This dog lives to the nines. What? Did you guys hear that? Okay, I need to figure out what settings makes the voices more. Let's try sound effects.
Nope, that's just awful. Did I go the right way? Where am I going? What am I doing? Yeah, her name is Duchess and she does rank outrank all of us. Going the right way, the wrong way. How do I level up? Oh, is that a secret? Nope. Animals are great. Why does he grunt so much? I don't like that my dude is so grunty. Fuck. The game is slippery. The dude is grunty. There's got to be some good I can get out of this. <laughs> the good that I'm getting out of it is the scream sound. <laughs> Dude, I'm just, I'm literally just walking here. I am a New Yorker. I am just walking here. Maybe that opened something up back there? He sounds like he was written by a teenage girl on AO3. <laughs> That's nothing. Okay, so I've accepted I may be lost for a while. Did this do anything over here? What is that? Oh, what the fuck? Oh, now it works. Let me through, please let me through, please let me through. Please let me through, please let me through. Please let me through. Can I go through? Nope. Oh, okay. That works, I guess. ambiently horny are awful. Oh. What? Why is it moving so slowly? Really hope that this actually takes me somewhere. Oh, a secret. I love walking around with one hand straight out and then lightly pushing it forward to punch. This is a really wimpy punch now that you mention it, actually. Please. Thank you. Have a good day. Boy, I sure do love how slowly this moves. This was a great decision for a game mechanic John Romero okay so oh oh no hold on is this dude blocking the no Dang it. Okay, yeah, let's try. No. The 
guys like this is the sound batteries make. Yeah, no, this is level two. The only problem is I have no idea where I'm going or what I'm. Let me try going down the poop hole again. Maybe in here somewhere. Did I turn this? Oh my god! Oh, Jesus. Okay. All right. We're just going down. Or, well, we can go up for a second again. This doesn't feel fair. Ooh. I got the... Okay, I'm not going to lie. That is... A little cool. You get a what? What? I'm upgrading this game from an obnoxious cartoon sound effect falling down a flight of stairs to this game sounds like its audio is directed by a toddler who's just been giving a novelty keyboard chock full of the worst joke sounds possible. Yeah, this... Is this a sex toy? I hate this game so much. So now I have to listen to this anytime I want to do melee damage. Each and every time I wish to use my melee weapon, I have to listen to what is possibly one of the worst sound effects of all time. Oh, and it increases the weapon switch time. Because of course it does! That is very clearly supposed to be something. I'm just going up the ladder. What? <sighs> All right. How do I turn the ladder on? God, that is a horrible sentence that I just had to say. How do I turn the ladder on? What the fuck? Oh, no. When's the last time I saved? Oh, please tell me this game auto saves. Also, did that projectile bounce against the water and kill me? Oh, no. Oh. Oh. No. <laughs> I know where to go. Well. Sir, you got in the way of my gun. I'm sorry. That was 100% your fault. Come on. There we go. Oh yeah, that's right. I take damage if I use it in water. That's so stupid. 
That's so dumb. This is my main projectile and I can't use it in what seems to be the one thing this game was proud of, which was how cool its water could glow. noise enemies make when they blow up is good. That's true. That's... Well, ow. Hey! Knock it off. Did I really kill everyone but the frog? Oh, I forgot to call the stupid elevator. Please go faster, I beg of you. You know, I'm starting to think that maybe John Romero didn't actually know anything about making video games. All he knows is how to hurt people. The elevator is like an anti-mini game. Really is what it feels like, though. Also, love how I go to all the trouble to get that secret, and then I'm just... By the time I can actually use it, it's not worth it! I forgot about that. And now I have to hit it again, and wait for the cutscene again. Why do the robot frogs rivet? Oh my god! Did that thing just fucking launch bounce mines? Careful of my own explosives. That sucks. God, even the weapons. Like, who wants an explosive that you have to wait? I have one explosive, and I have to wait for it. Why? Yes, I am going to save now. I know that other streamers have like the donate bits to blank thing. That should be my only donate bits to blank thing. Well, are you fucking kidding me? Is it stuck now? But no, I should just do donate bits to remind me to save. Okay, this is probably gonna, whoa, shit.
that sounded promising. Where's the... You know what? It's not a problem anymore. Or at least it's not my problem anymore. Never found out how to open. Let me figure out how to open this. What? Oh, now it works! Donate and eventually you'll remember to save. Yes! Ow. If you donate, I'll be better at video games, and watching this stream will be less painful. Sorry, not bits, channel points. That's what I was thinking of, I think. I don't know. I don't know how Twitch works. Try standing far away and shooting it. There we go. This is fine. Everything's fine. No one needs to comment on what happened. No one. Okay. I'm aware that was in fact an L. Here, nope. Oh, shit. Okay. I, you know what? I really wish I hadn't picked this up. This feels like, hey, what if we made the worst level in Half Life an entire game? They were trying real hard to make this bad. And they succeeded. John Romero invented the first game with no dubs. It was just you hadn't picked it up either. Yeah, it was just kind of hanging out there, man. Hold on. Ow, ow, ow. I am going to save. There is definitely something to get up there. There's something up there. Is that really it? Is that all that's down here? Oh. Oh, okay. And now because I... Yeah, so that was just to get air. Wait, what? What? Oh. How am I supposed to... Okay, I understand now. And now... Please? Please? Oh my god, how the fuck am I supposed to do this? Well, that didn't work. Okay. One more time. This time with more health. Maybe.
Okay, yeah, so that's not gonna work. I have to wait for it to go down. I think. So I'm gonna wait for it to fill. And then I go down. And then... Please? Please? Nope. 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 I'm gonna get some air again. Wish there was a breath meter. There probably is. I can't just... I just can't see it. Because, you know... Die Katana be Die Katana. Ow. John Romero created the the first game capable of feeling, but the only feeling is hate. What happened? What killed me? What just happened? Okay, it's fine. I have 13 health, and I'm playing a very bad video game. It's fine. I'm gonna save again. Oh! This is on easy. God, if I'd actually stuck through playing on hard... Fuck that. Oh. That probably could have killed me. John Romero himself appeared and struck you down. Why are they being born anyway? They're machines. That's too high concept for John Romero! I've learned not to curse John Romero's name while playing his video game. Oh. I don't know how I made that jump without dying. That was... Pure luck, I'm gonna save. I should not have done that. Can I, can I get through here somehow? Please? 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 Will you let me through? Will you let me back up? Nope! Okay, this is fine, this is okay. We are still in the second level, but it's fine. Can you, sir? I'm just trying to, sir? Sir, can I please just, Sir. Fine. I I asked him to get out of the way. I asked him very politely. John Romero bullied me in high school and captured the essence of all that pain and transformed it into a video game. Yeah, that's the thing. I don't think John Romero has ever been bullied. John Romero... Well, okay, he's been bullied on the internet many, many times. Translated the death on the Japanese in the death screen. It just says big. Once again, knowing John Romero, that is not just entirely possible. That is the most plausible. Why is it suddenly so slippery? It was slippery before. Now it's like horrible slippery. Oh, I leveled up. 
cool. Please die. Okay, thank you. I'm gonna save. Okay. You know, I figured those would take a lot more to kill. This whole time I've been dancing around them and and playing this mind game with explosives, but no. Shot cycler shells. they did oh shit guys bad news I just had fun with Daikatana and it was entirely the games do it can I just get up here wait hold on how do I level up All right, let's check the keyboard, crouch, ne next weapon, run, sidestep, look up, uh, show all HUDs. HUD cycle? What? Okay. Talk, talk to team. Oh my god. I keep forgetting there's teams in this. Jump, operate, attack. I hope that I level up, like, at the end of the level or something. Really hope there's not just some sort of mystery option that I've been accidentally ignoring the entire game. Man, these things suck. For it. He made this game and thought multiple. Oh, he thought this was going to like. He thought this was going to be game of the century and blow away Quake. Ow! Oh shit, I'm being shot at by people with guns. Guys, I'm not gonna fucking do anything. I love Star Trek. Okay, I'm just gonna go through here, guys. Okay, guys. Which one of you is gonna do it? We're doing it three times worked? The other times didn't? Headquarter building my ass. This looks more like a prison. Cancel prisoner transfer from detention block four. Orders from central commander to keep priority one prison. Okay. That's gotta be Mikiko. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I just love how they're still screaming. Hold on, I need to Google something quickly. 
die katana levels. 24? Level up. I still never figured that out. Is that a configure? No, not again. Why did I shoot? Wait a minute. I recognize this. This is the first level from the N64 game, I think. Which is supposedly when it gets bad. Oh, won't budge. Man, this sure is sound design. running from me? Are you scared? Or are you just like taking a jog? Oh, there we go. Now he's scared. Can I play video games too? Let me try your controller. Let me try this one. Ow! That was a slurp noise, alright. Ah! Ooh, that's a secret. That looks actually pretty cool. Plastisteel armor. I can't get out. There we go. Oh, no, no, no. I was going to say, this is... Together, we will discover why this game was so hated. We haven't gotten there yet. Can I punch through this? Please? Hold on. I have to figure out how to... No. St stop doing that. I have to figure out how to level up. Level up. Die. Katana. There we go. Um, it just says read the game manual. Oh, hold on. Um, a and L? What? What? And then... Wait. Hold on. I've almost got this. K and L. How do I select the skill? Please stop screaming. Let's do it. Nope. Oh, here we go. That, that all sounded very bad. Oh. Nope, these are my friends. Okay. 
way. Please stop screaming. Oh, won't budge. Oh, won't budge. Oh, won't budge. Oh my god, please stop screaming. Okay, I need to figure out. HUD next. Oh, HUD use. There we go. So it's semicolon. Yes, I'm going to save. Thank you for reminding me. Also, um, the fuck is semicolon on my keyboard? Oh. Shoot that. Oh my god. Oh my god. How did this get released? I just love the really deep, like, scary voice. We don't hurt me! Like, if you're gonna make a place sound like it's filled with torture and horrible things, maybe record more than two lines. Did I soft lock or something? What am I doing wrong? That, that's not working. Okay. Um. This? I am completely stuck. Please stop, you guys. It's just depressing. Does anyone have any knowledge of Dai Katana? I... I can't believe this. I think I have to look up a walkthrough guide. Oh my god. Uh, Dai Katana walkthrough. Oh, oh man, it's Game Facts, and it's like... The old ASCII art game facts. Okay. Um. Uh. Oh wait. Episode one. Uh, mission three. Go to the doors in front of you. Go to the console. Try and open the door. Password is rejected. Wait for the employee to come by and open it for you. Follow the hall into the turbine room. Uh, oh wait. Is this the N64 one? Yep, that's Dai Katana for the N64. Dai Katana PC. Yeah, these levels, I think none of the levels that I've played are even in the N64 version. Okay. Dai Katana, explanations, explanations, words, words, words. I don't want words, I want answers! Oh, wait, I skipped past the answer. <laughs> okay. Episode one, map. Three, 
before? Crematorium. Uh, oh, no, no, no. No, no, no. I'm on map three right now. Solitary. Um, Mishima guards and invaders. Uh, blah, blah, blah. System thinking is not about to enter any normal prison. Crawl onto the staircase. I got that. Now leave this room. Grab the C4 and the ion blaster ammo. T across here to the left. Take out the guards. And pass the cells. Turn to your right. Blow up the monitor for the generator behind the screen. This turns off the force fields. Uh, head past the escaping prisoners. Sidewinder rockets. Open the door. Bo. Oh, no. <laughs> Bo! <laughs> Is that what you've been working on this entire time? Oh, my God! Oh, it'll have to overlap Pride Shop a little bit, but... Oh my god, okay. Um, board the lift in the center. Thank you so much, Bo. Bo, you are a god. Board the lift in the center of the room. Press the. Wait. Enter the yellow lit corridor. What? What am I doing wrong? Okay. Yellow lit corridor. Oh my god! That's so dumb. And everyone in chat missed it, which means that I wasn't at fault. done variations of this joke so many times but this time instead of brute forcing the lettering by hand I finally caved and downloaded an actual font Bo you are amazing oh my god oh whoa oh cool better gun ow Okay. I guess I just stubbed my toe or something. Oh, hey. I don't understand why it fires and bursts. It is not a coconut gun. Yes, Bo, please post your Twitter because I want your, your well, actually, do you have a Twitter? I know you have a Tumblr. I follow you on Tumblr. Do you have a Twitter? <laughs> Sir? Sir? Stop. 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 Honestly, you dodged so many attacks. Um, I'm just going to let him live. Did I miss something do I just stand here now or do I door won't open will that do it That didn't work at all. What am I missing again? It. This game. What's so frustrating about this game, besides, like, you know, everything else, is that. It is completely lacking in 
any and all like suggestive design saying hey this is where it's, it's a good idea to go here there's just none of that this feels like a fan of this feels like a fan level of a better game this feels like a bad quake mod Oh, they're saying the metals. That's what they're yelling. Okay, what am I missing this time? All right, we are, oh. God, these buttons. This shotgun sucks. Is it really gonna make me fire multiple shots at once? I got more shells. I think so. I think you just have to unload a shit ton of. Sir? Oh! Good news, I ran out of ammo! Nope, that didn't do anything. I thought that he was stuck. I was trying to push him out of the way. I was trying to help him. Okay, that drains my health. Uh... Okay, so there is definitely a valve puzzle in there. Also, in my defense, I think, I think these guys might be evil. Maybe. I don't know. I'm just gonna say that. This is obnoxious. Oh, wait, hold on. Is that... See, that would have killed him anyways. Which, to be fair, still would have been my doing. Okay, now it makes sense that they're hiding from me. I have killed a lot of their friends by this point. What? What are you? I... Hold on. I'm gonna save. Now I'm going to shoot it. Oh, hold on. I am going to load that game. Hold on. I have an idea. Maybe if I... There we go. Oh boy, guys, they're scanning. Hope they don't find me. I've been such a naughty little Daikatana. Oh no, does it make the so that sound every time I jump? I can't get out. I can't get out. I'm stuck. This isn't even a bit. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Oh my god!
How do I get out? It's a really good thing that I saved right there. Oh no, step guy Daikatana, I'm stuck. Shut up. stand up there, I die. I already have one of those, but thank you. I'd like whatever I get to use the rockets in, please. I'm not, like, misusing this thing, am I? Is it supposed to, like, go through six shots every time I use it? I mean, that was kind of cool for a sec. Whoa! Buddy! What are you doing? And why do you look like that? Oh my god! Did you go diving on a McDonald's ketchup packet? Okay, I can kill these guys and none of you would, like, be upset, right? Because these guys... These guys are very clearly evil. These guys get the fisted. Um, good, good luck, buddy. Yeah, you get exploded, you get exploded. And, um... Oh, God, that guy's just already dead. Should I try and let these guys out? Hello, sir. It's like these guys look like if someone made a mech out of a Mr. Potato Head. Like, like someone put a Mr. Potato Head on a full body that like a mech was just a big flesh suit Hus portal <laughs> that sounds dumb Once again, there is no kind way for me to say this, but guys, please stop screaming. <laughs> One guy was doing the soy face. Um, ooh, I can jump over there and grab that. I think I can anyways. Let's find out. I made it. Oh, what's this? Did I find, I found a secret. Oh my god, it just sent me back here. Fuck. I don't have to redo this whole thing. I've got to get to the bad part before I give up. I don't want to give up until until we've gotten to the certified bad part. 
And I know that that sounds like I'm just talking in circles that we haven't gotten to the bad part yet. But I am well aware of what, air quotes, the bad part is. And we are definitely not there yet. nothing up here hi i'm here for the suffering wow you're just in time because as far as i know we're about to get to the suffering it already sucks but it's hopefully soon gonna suck even more still don't understand why it just keeps shooting I don't think I ever will understand. The mind of John Romero is one of true brilliance. Okay, there's no button next to it that I missed. So it's not that. Is there something in here I missed? Oh, this. There we go. There we go. I mean, I yeah, I I do like the splatters. Now that someone pointed it out, the splatter sound effects when I kill a dude is pretty radical. I'm energized by the Wraith Orb. Oh shit, I'm invisible! I need this. Okay, that's cool. Oh shit. I didn't mean to do that. Um Also, I love that the wording is you needed a health kit. Like, dude, at that point, I had so much health, I basically just stubbed my toe. I thought I needed that. I guess I was wrong. I wonder what the difference between power and attack is. I'm going to save. This was a bad idea. Chunky. Why does it have to do the click? Nope. Oh, God. That's... 
John Romero had one good thing, and it's the splatter sounds. My god. How is this a secret? Ow. Oh, was I able to go through there before? What did that do? Like how when you die, you become several cubes of meat. Yeah, you do. Oh, how do we get up there? Oh, can I only get up there if I have high enough uh, acro? Sound an alarm, but not for me! Ow, my eyes! Man, you toasted those dudes, but good, thanks. No matter what the hell was that anyway, just another oh, just another one of Mishima's toys. Some sort of heavy duty torture device, pretty nasty, eh? Now how about you lending me a hand and opening my cell? How about some information first? Speak. I'm looking for someone. She's only been locked up in here for a couple of weeks. An Asian an Asian girl What I mean I thought we were in Japan. I thought this was in Japan. Also, I think this is Superfly. And if this is Superfly, now, now the video game is going to be bad. I love how you can just barely vaguely hear something happening. Whoop. Um, fuck. Where did he say to go? I wasn't paying any attention. Oh, that's a... That's a meat cube. For meat. Okay, he definitely told me how to rescue him. But, like... How am I supposed to pay attention to this game? Also, who just keeps heads on hooks? Uh, do I go this way again? Do I go back? I really don't know. I was not paying any attention to what that dude said. It's called interior design. Speaking of the main character being named Usagi, every time, every fucking time that they say that, I immediately can only think of Sailor Moon. And honestly, that's the one thing that could have saved this game. Sailor Moon. Yes. 
the characters have Japanese names in the way that a ton of people's anime OCs have. This is what I was saying. This is why I was saying this is a weeaboo game. This is just John Romero's weeaboo fantasy. Oh, shit. I shouldn't have gone this way. Fuck. Fuck. No. No. Superfly Johnson sure is a name. Time to wait for the clicks. Okay, there we go. Okay, where was I going? I don't remember. Okay, I went this way. And then... Wait, hold on. Do I have to go down? Let me try going down. Never mind. I was already here. I remember this now. I would say I wish I was paying attention to the story so I knew what to do. But honestly... One, I don't know if that would have helped. And two, anything is better than paying attention to a John Romero story. Okay, we'll try going back up. Superfly Johnson very much feels like a white weeb's totally insensitive name for his only black character that he doesn't understand why people think is kind of racist. God, I was thinking the same thing! Wait, is it th this? How do I free you again? Access denied. Oh. Dude, can you just, like, tell me again, please? I really was not listening. Uh. Ow. Oh, hold on. Oh! I got the prison cell key card. Is that what he... That's probably what he told me in that... You know, in that... Cutscene. By the way, sorry the screen is so tiny. This is the highest resolution I could get it in. Oh, great! Thanks, Lamp! Hey, good news! I just got to the worst part! Hello, Duckman. Oh, fuck it, Skelsner and Vanant. Oh my god, please move faster. Please move faster. Nope! Stop that! I just realized, I don't think the AI in this gets a gun for now! Hey, everyone who does not know about, um, this train wreck of a game. Welcome to Dai Katana, the game that destroyed uh, John Romero's entire career. Body parts. Nasty. <laughs> what the fuck? Body parts. Nasty. Buddy Superfly. Can't leave the area without my buddy Superfly. Why is it so quiet? I'd like to imagine that uh, the reason that it's so quiet is because they're whispering during all of the cutscenes. They're just, who whooped you? And what? A pretty boy like you probably can't imagine the kind of crap that goes on in behind these closed doors. The constant torture and abuse of prisoners. Blacked out experiments to test folks' threshold of pain. Pretty oh, Jesus, my eyes! Oh, God! Close up on a three polygon saw blade.
Uh huh. Yes, it does. Yep. Oh, it is missing all of the frame data for Superfly. What is happening? I'm red, green, colorblind. I didn't anything. Honestly, be glad. The more of this you miss, the better off your time will be. Is this secretly Tekken? God, I fucking wish. Oh yeah, we're also playing on John Romero mode because apparently, Skelsner and Venant, they, they left the developer's settings in the game. And for reasons I don't understand, John Romero's settings were tear your eardrums out. I'm just gonna skip this. I don't care. I don't like you, super flat. Wait, hold on. Can I go back here? Nope, I don't wanna. Does he have a gun? He's got a fist. Oh, nope. I shot Superfly. Is John Romero a sadist? Genuinely, yes. And that was the whole reason that the ad campaign was John Romero's hey, about to man. make you his bitch. Watch where you going. Because infamously, what did his death animation replay when I walked in the room? What the fuck happened? Did you explode him, Superfly? Also, I love how his feet look kind of like he stepped into toasters. <laughs> oh my god! The what the fuck is that book supposed to be? Bring it on! Okay, well, he has a gun now. Can I shoot through this? Nope. Hold on a second. Is that a pipe organ rendition of E1M1? Huh. Also, absolutely wild how in March of 2022, in response to the Russian invasion of Ukraine, Romero created a new level of Doom 2. That's one of the, this is one of the things that I both love and hate about this game so far is like, I, I was saying this earlier, this feels like a fine wine of bad video games. Like everything about it. Is it's not in the normal realm of bad video game. It's small stuff, like adding, like adding a ticker sound effect to every loading screen, of which there are many, or adding a leveling system into a shooter and not telling you how to do it. I know you keep saying it's curled milk, but this is a wine. This is a fine pignon. This is, this is a French hey, blanc, whatever. I don't drink wine of bad video game. Oh, okay. I guess they're just letting us in here with nothing to do. Anyways. Hey, Lamp. How did, um, uh, how, how did, uh, how, how did the Yugi goes? Find a way to open this loading dock door. Yes, I know that. Aged Briar Cheese game. Oh man, I need to lose some health so I can show everyone eating berries. Um. 
Oh, hey. Let me use my shotgun that unloads six rounds at a time. And you can't do anything more or less. Where did Superfly go? Okay, I found him. It's a can of lukewarm old flat soda you left out at your birthday party and then no one showed up. Um, have any hot dogs tried to kill you recently? I mean, this game is pretty close to... Oh, okay. Hey, Hero! Yes? Hero, come on! Let's move along. We need to bust some more skulls. I thought that... I'm not going to lie. I thought that said loading cock. That's the worst font ever. Thank you for showing me... that. Why does this dude's computer just have a coffin on it? Ditch him next time. I don't want to hear his horrible voice acting. Uh, that's the problem. Like you need him to go everywhere. And the game will stop you if your buddy Superfly is not there. Now, I guess we're going to find out if this is... Because I know that apparently they released a patch that made it less painful... So maybe this is that patch? I can't leave without my buddy Superfly. I can't leave without my buddy Superfly. What? He's right there! What was the difference? I didn't do anything different! He was right- Oh my god. Okay, I'm starting to get it. I'm starting to get it. It's okay. I love you, Superfly. Whoa, Jesus! Oh, my God. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. I have not saved. I have not saved. We're going to do that. I can't leave behind my boy, Superfly. He's too important. Did I just hear a robot say sexy figure? Hey man, watch where you going. Can I? Why did he take a <laughs> second? Thank you, Manacle Cat, for following. Oh, hey, now I have the rocket launcher. I am going to save again. And resume. I am now locked in here. No, I'm not. Never mind. We're good. Guys, the screaming is back. Can I have that? this game was secretly horny, it wouldn't fix everything, but it would be better just say... No, that's the thing. This game is extremely horny so <laughs> far. Also, thank you, Super Boob, for following. Alright, we're back at the point of where the fuck am I going? What the fuck am I doing? Uh, did I miss something in here? Oh. What? Ah, yes. Coffin computer. That. Do I need to load Superfly into the coffin? Let's move! Oh, no. Okay, um... Hold on, I have to pull up the... Okay, uh, swap sidekick, sidekick get, stay, attack, 
back off. Let me try swap sidekick. You could just ask me to move. I need you. Superfly. Superfly. No, I need you to. Superfly. Hold on. Um. Stay. Yes, yeah, stay. So V, V, V. I'm cool with that. I'll be right here. Hold on, what? Chill, dude. I'm coming. Come, come on. I would if I could, man. I need you to stand right there. Superfly. Okay. Superfly, come here. No, come here, Superfly. Come here. No, 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 get, no, no. No! What the fuck happened? Why are you fucking kidding me? Okay, it's fine. It's fine. Okay, Superfly. Superfly, we're gonna go this way. And I'm gonna need you to get out quickly. Okay. okay I'm gonna need you to come here. Oh, shit. Um. Hey. Get off of me! Superfly! Okay. Okay, Superfly. I'm on my way. I'll be there in a sec. Oh my god, is he stuck on the ladder? What happens if I go to... <laughs> oh my god! Okay, now that I've gone up the ladder... Come on, Superfly. There we go. Holy shit! Okay. I'm on my way. Come here, Superfly. I'm on my way. Okay, this way. I'll be there in a sec. I'll be there in a sec. Superfly. Okay. Now we go this way. Okay, now I need you to get I'm on my way. On here. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, no, no. I understand what I need to do. So he needs to be. Oh, my God. I have to move him like a box. Okay. All right, Superfly. You got to get up here. I'll be right here. And then you stay right there. Okay, hold on. I've got this. I've got this. And now I move my... B what the fuck is that? Now I move my best friend Superfly through... Because the door is going to open to take the coffin. And now... What? They sold this game for money. This game didn't just have a budget. This game had a massive budget. This game... This game was advertised across the world. Imagine being a fan of Doom or Quake and purchasing this for money. Okay, so obviously that wasn't right. All right, that makes that fart. just want to skip past this. What's the point of this? Can I get in the coffin? Oh 
Oh my god, back in the day when you could rent video games. The, the fart juice is coming out, but like, what does that do? Ah! There we go. I thought I was stuck. Get off me! Shut up, Superfly. Okay. There's got to be something I'm missing here. Um. Because now there, okay, now there's not a coffin, so I'm afraid to save. I'm going to try again now that there's not a coffin. Maybe one of the other coffins is empty. That's not a bad idea. Um, never mind. These buttons just don't work anymore. Oh, I almost punched Superfly. As a lone consolation, this game was released around this time of year, so at least it probably wasn't gifted to many kids as a Christmas present. You know, that does make me feel better. Superfly! Superfly! Yeah, let me try. No. That doesn't do anything. All right, we're, we're consulting the walkthrough. Okay, crematorium. You learn a little bit about Superfly's uh, uh, horrid past, uh, blah, blah, blah. Birds and the Rage Masters. Uh, put down the Rage Master and take out the laser gat on the wall. Grab the save gem, turn around, shoot the top off the coffee table in the center. Secret gamer technique, break everything until something happens. Collect the health. Blah, blah, blah. I did that. I did that. I did that. Dude, using a walkthrough, I still can't tell what I'm doing wrong. Am I just not supposed to be in here? Can't, I can't leave the area without my buddy Superfly. Let me try punching it. Chill, dude, I'm coming. I'll be there in a sec. Okay, Superfly. I'll be there in a sec. Superfly. I think. No, that doesn't make sense. I'm. What am I not getting? Enter the ramp. Uh, run up the ramp and enter the lobby of the. Oh, hold on. Okay, I'm in the wrong section. That's why. Um. Destroy the Rage Master and guards on the loading dock entrance ramp. And the door to enter the bee's nest. That's the most... Okay, so the most frustrating part of this is that, like... I can't tell, based on the actual walkthrough, where I am... Fuck this, I'm watching a video. 
Ignore any sounds you might hear. I managed to mute it in time. I'm just gonna... Oh, hold on. Okay. I am watching the walkthrough. They are... Nope. That's not the section I was at. John Romero wrote the walkthrough. I'd like to imagine he was just desperate for people to play his game. I am concerned that they immediately saved going into this room. Okay, so... So you're supposed to go on there. Wait, what? Oh. How the f How was I supposed... Okay, which now ruins this. Why the fuck was that so loud? Why was gravity just decreased? Where you going? Shut up, Superfly. Wow, this rocket launcher is awful. Why are oh I was gonna say, why was Superfly shooting me? I wonder if, were there any, I, I actually, no, I can't even ask if there were any fans of this game. I know there are, because when I looked at the Steam walkthrough, one of the top comments was, actually, it's a lot better than a lot of people think. They're just not willing to give it the time or, or energy required to appreciate it. Like, dude, maybe that means it's not good. Am I supposed to be here? I think I might have skipped something. Nope. Ow. Romero wrote those comments. Don't like that sound, but you know, it hasn't come to kill me yet. What's the point of the... What's the point of anything in this game? I'm gonna explode this, dude. At least that's still satisfying. At least the exploding of dudes still can bring a, a like, just a single, s tiny, solitary smile to my face. Oh. Oh, that's where I'm supposed to go. I see now. Never mind. Ignore all complaints that I've made. I understand now. Can I go up? Please? There we go. Ow. Really hope this is the actual way to go and not just a secret. Knowing this game... You probably would need him to open that door. Implying the game drains energy from you is not a glowing review. It is not. When's the last time I saved? I don't. I. Hmm. Okay, we're just gonna... It's fine. This is fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. And then we stand back. And 
we let it flood. Holy shit, that guy survived that! You know, the game may feel like it's controlled by grease, but now that I've gotten used to the grease, it's not the worst grease I've ever slid on. You go ahead. I'll wait here. Why does it kill me every five seconds? Because John Romero is an asshole. Let me on there. I'm going to use the dumb shotgun now. How am I supposed to? Nope, that doesn't work. Um. John Romero thought the best part of Doom was how often people died playing his game. It does feel like iced grease. Oh, okay, I just have to go, like, around a wide way. That's dumb, but okay. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna save again. Now. <laughs> okay, we're good. We're gonna save again. And resume. After them! Why do we keep getting stuck guarding this sector? What was that voice? Oh my god, I know. Ow. Here they come. Who is that voice actor? Ow! <laughs> they did the fucking counter strike human ladder on me! They just made a fucking cheerleader pyramid! <laughs> Superfly go. Whoop. Oh, that fires way more than one rocket. That's why I was having troubles with it. That's now. Oh, I'm going to die. This is fine. The thing is, even though I recognize the sound, there's no way I'm going to recognize the name. 
it was just enough to activate like a half second neuron burst. You have to find Superfly before he finds out he's too good for this game and leaves. No, Superfly is the worst part of this game. That man was probably just working here. I shouldn't have done that. Man, this really is a John Romero game. Wait, oh shit, Superfly's VA actually had a career after this? That's amazing. Huh? Intruder alert, sound the alarm! Oh my god, that was very close. I love how the dude saw me. Saw I like backed up into a corner and was just like, up, oh, nothing you can do. It's the little things that confuse me. Like the fact that there is a full health item here. You, you charge full health, but they also felt the need, just in case, to put another one right here. Intruder alert, sound the alarm. That is true, a lot of VAs from the late 90s were just devs. Or stock sound effects. I still love that the sound of the uh, uh, the imps from Doom is a camel. I can't leave without my buddy Superfly. I can't leave without my buddy Superfly. Oh fuck, I actually do have to go back and get him. Oh shit. Starting to get now why that was a meme. Where did he go? He was here, right? Oh. There's Superfly. Great job, hero. Is my name Hero? I thought that wasn't my name. Please move faster, Superfly. I'm begging you, please. The door won't open. But I just came through there. And Superfly can't follow me. Mm. Mm. I am reaching a transcendent state of being upset at video games. Superfly. Oh, okay. Hold on. I think he might be coming. Chill, dude, I'm coming. Oh, that sounded close. Chill, dude, I'm coming. I'll be there in a sec. I'm on my way. Chill, dude, I'm coming. Come on. I'll be there in a oh, sec. shit. Out. Superfly, what? Did he get stuck in the closed door? Superfly, where are you? Where did Superfly go? We lost Superfly! What? Seriously, where is he? What? What? All four of the people, uh... In Dai Katana, went out of other voice acting roles. We're all cast in Borderlands 3. Do you think that was the curse? I shouldn't say that. I haven't actually played Borderlands 3 yet. 
Please let me through. Okay. Where did... Superfly! Superfly? What? How? How? Whatever. He's right here! You killed him twice and now you lost him. Do you not get for Superfly? I don't know, buddy. I, 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 I don't know. Maybe I... Oh, that was satisfying. <laughs> I really hope that that door doesn't kill Superfly. Like pushing me around. Superfly, I don't like pushing you around. It's a necessity. Ow! Ow! Okay. This can't be happening. You've been bitch slapped into oblivion. I'm gonna be real. I almost called him pork chop for a second there. That's how upset I am right now. You know what? I'm just gonna reload. I'm just gonna reload. Why does it take so long to load? Did John Romero really not consider that consoles and computers might be a little better in the future than they were when this game was made? Hero was a uh, PA Honeywell and Jabber. Superfly has been in every. Bo oh shit, that's Brick! That's why! Huh. I was like, this whole time I was like, I want to fully hate you, Superfly, but there's something about you that's just not entirely hateable. And it's because you're also Brick. Oh my god, is he proto Brick? Hey, that's your ass, Lego. What the fuck did you just say to me, Superfly? What does that mean? I'm gonna save again. Do you, okay, can you look up who the voice actor for the guards is? Or was that also just some dude? What the, what, okay. Is Brick laughing at me or crying? Goodbye, hero. <laughs> Watch where you going. You know what, Brick? You can solve this. Have fun, Brick. Okay, maybe, maybe. I wait. Did I call him Brick? Did I call him Brick or Superfly? Sounds like the guy from Lego City that fell in the river. He sounds like the police officers from Payday Two. But also a little like Steve Bloom, but just a little. I 
think there's a guard. Oh! Superfly, you got this. No, he doesn't. Body and watch it burn up all at once. What the fuck do you mean, Superfly? Quit your intruder alert. Sound the alarm. Am I supposed to be in the coffin? <laughs> hey, buddy. How you doing? You okay? How's work going? Looks a little toasty in there. Here, let me I'm help you. Alive, nope. <laughs> Probably be Earl Fisher, Jeremy Swartz, but they don't have any specific characters outside of additional voices. I'll I'll figure it out off stream, and if, I'll, I'll I'll tweet and tumble about it if I figure it out. Hey, that's your ass, Layla. <sighs> Superfly. Wait, hold on, hold on, no. I hope this is a secret and not the actual way I was supposed to go. Okay. Oh my god. I, like a rat. I hated that. That's awful. Oh, that's the actual way I was supposed to go. Intruder alert. All right, that is the next thing I would like to complain about about this game is how goddamn long it takes to switch a weapon. This is just a normal weapon switch. But they change between them. Specifically, the fist, for some reason, takes time. Going down, I think, takes long. I don't know. Look alive, folks. Here they come. Glad that's still fun. Where did Superfly go? Come on. Come on. Come on. Yeah, why the fuck is there a jump puzzle and a doom clone? What? That was the level? Okay. Alright, I'll take it. Superfly go. What? Well, where did Superfly go? Oh my god. <clears throat> Imagine if we lost Superfly. That would have been. Oh boy. They're back. Aiming in this game feels like maybe you can open it from the other side. Honestly, there's nothing I can compare to. I need to get some anger out. That felt good. I'm glad this guy is not like running from me and scared of me. Sidewinder rockets. You like pushing me around? No, I don't. Maybe. Where, 
What is this? Okay, this looks like it picks up things. Oh boy, we're stuck again! Great! Superfly, come this way. Nope, that didn't do anything. Maybe I... Oh! Oh, hello! Hello! Does that do anything? Please, no! No more bugs! Oh, I forgot that that damages me! I don't want to drown on green Gatorade. Oh boy, I got the shock sphere. Whatever the fuck that is. Can't reach it. Wait, is Superfly just gonna hang out up there? Want me to crack a skull or two while you wait? Okay, two things that really piss me off about this game. I was so mad I completely forgot what they were, but I'm sure they'll come up again. Ignore that I said that. What the, what's the point of this room? I remembered what it was. Why does the game keep giving me power-ups that I'm unable to use? Like, it'll give me, hey, you can do quad damage now. Or you can jump real high now, and it's like, hey, that's cool. Thank you. Except then it doesn't give me any enemies until that section is done. It's not rewarding my exploration. Oh my god. Let me back in there. No! Oh, what? Oh my God! No, no, no! Come on! It's fine. Do not slip off the rock. Okay. Oh, there was a ladder. Oh, wait. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. I'm dying, but I don't care. Oh, perfect. Why is that so bright? Should I shoot it? Lamp. I just shot myself trying to open a door. Do you think I'm John Romero's bitch yet? The answer is yes. Yes, and I have been for three hours, six, t six minutes, and 18 seconds. You know what? 
Superfly can just wait. I don't need Superfly. Um. <laughs> I love how they do just look out like, who the fuck, man? <laughs> Hold on. Is he, is he trying to, sir, there's nothing up there. I guess maybe he's just cleaning the fan blade now. Just kind of like wiping it off by hand. Cause I got machine gun. Ah! Oh, it's fine. It's not fine. It's fine. It's fine. But is it fun? What? Oh no. Whoa, 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 what? What just happened? What? What just happened? What? Huh? What? Uh, okay. Alright. I'm not gonna think about it too much. Think about it. Bad I things happen. I can't leave without my buddy Superfly. I can't leave without my buddy Superfly! It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. Lamp buddy, I know you just did your own stream, but would you like in on this? This amazing fun I'm having, this absolutely stupendous time becoming John Romero's side piece. Door won't open. Cool, give me. Why am I sliding? Oh my god, I figured it out. Hold on, lamp. Before I answer, I'm not touching anything right now. They forgot to remove something on slopes. That's why occasionally it's a slippery mess and occasionally it's not. Well, hello there, Lamp. Hi. How you doing, buddy? Oh, I'm doing all right. It's good to hear. Uh, now, I apologize. Um, Daikatana can't be in full screen, so uh, so you get tiny screen. Dude, that is that is fine. I I I I detest full screen. I usually like it, but right now I hate everything that's happening. Right, I. What is your desktop background, my man? Um, I don't want to answer that because then you're going to bully me. You're right. <laughs> <laughs> so let's just get to the part where I get to bully you. It's the uh, <clears throat> album cover to Polygon Wanna Land. Hit, hit, hit album by Australian psych rockers King Gizzard and the Lizard Wizard. I didn't really think it was possible for you to be a parody of yourself. You're a pretty diverse guy, but uh, now I guess you managed, huh? Look, you don't understand. The album's really I good. think I do understand, <laughs> Veggie. Let me have brainworms over something. <laughs> I get brainworms over one thing at a time, and it usually lasts about three years. Oh, God damn it! that's what it was. Brainworms. <laughs> Chopping up dead bodies. What so I'm surprised fuck? you've dedicated this much to Daikatana. You know, Lord I, knows I gave up by this point. That's the worst part about Daikatana is like, fucking god damn it, there's like a shred of something fun in here. 
You, you want to know how much time I'm putting to no, die, Katana? No, no, turn around. How much? Why don't, you, why don't you take a guess? Why don't you take a guess at my Steam playtime on, Di play on Daikatana? Because I did notice you were the only other friend of mine that owned Di Daikatana. Yeah, I much like you, I bought it on a lark. Uh, I'm guessing two, uh, uh, two hours? I can't. 14 minutes. Wow, you didn't even get to Superfly Johnson, <laughs> our best friend. We can't live without our buddy Superfly. I... <laughs> I, I was straight up not having fun. <laughs> no, no amusement whatsoever. What is it? What is hurting me? What is hurting me? The game, bro. The game. Every. I. Yes, you were one minute off, but by Price is Right rules, no one won. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. This is horrible for my ears. So how did the Yu-Gi-Oh Yu-Gi go? Oh, uh, it went uh, it went well. I I did not win, not out of a lack of trying, mind you. <laughs> as as, Aram, as I expected. Aram has been has been winning a lot, and and I really want to take him down, but like this whole this whole last stream was such a a drag out. A drag out sort of ordeal. Like Aram still won both of his sets, but he was a devastated man after <laughs> winning both of his sets. <laughs> it was very much one of those like, yeah, you won, but at what cost? Like Like in his second set against Soup, he took he took like six thousand five hundred points of damage in two turns. <laughs> Like, he took an insane amount of damage, just out of nowhere, Jinzo, but boom But, um, yeah, no, it was a, it was a good stream. Um, and I take it you've been having an equally good stream. Uh, I've had a stream. I see you found the Shot Cycler as the only decent weapon in this game. Yeah, I was gonna say, um, <clears throat> sure is great how you can only fire six shots. Yeah. What, you wanted to have fun with this thing? I was in in actuality, the Sidewinder is like there is surprisingly a lot of ammo for it, and I'm trying to make things at least at, li at least a little entertaining by not stomping the game with it. But <laughs> mm -hmm. honestly, I don't owe the game that. Not at all. Sidewinder is one of my favorite words. Sidewinder was a great Halo map. Veggie, do you have a favorite word? Um, I do, radical. and I actually have radical. That's a good word. So I, I very much have a favorite word, and, and it's it's funny uh, that this is my permanent memory because because uh, my sister, uh, my sister actually asked me about it. My older sister, and the relationship we have is great uh, because uh, I've sort of always been the person that I am. I'm sort of a non-stop shit heel, so she has uh, she has sort of infinite bullshit tolerance, um, which is why she gets along so well with her boyfriend. Um, but she uh, she asked me one day, she's like, "Do you have a favorite word?" And I said yes. And before I could answer, she said, "Yeah, you seem like you do," <laughs> <laughs> which which destroyed me. But, yes, I very much have a favorite word. It is lark. Like, like to do yeah. something on a lark as oh, a joke. I, I thought you were saying lark like the bird. I mean, I do like the bird. What is this? Um... Who fucking cares, dude? It's teal now. <laughs> Alright, hope you liked it. <laughs> what was the pointed... Am I fighting in a McDon- Is this Burger Town? This is the infinite McDonald's. Oh, that was a civilian. Oh my god, is this that episode of Spongebob with the automated burgers? Oh but my god. real? Oh. You could press the button five or six times, or just once. Why is it making heartbeat sounds? Why do you care? That's a good point. 
Your apathy keeps me going. <laughs> it's it's all I can offer. <laughs> Wait, so the burgers go... Am I, like, next to a McDonald's? See, I'm glad you still have enough childlike whimsy after playing Daikatana for three hours, 16 minutes, and 42 seconds to, uh, to still be looking at what's going on in the level geometry, you know? That, that's the thing. The only reason I still am is because this is, like, it's confusingly bad. <laughs> it's astonishing. What an amazing vision that was executed dog shittily. Exactly. It's. I was saying this at the beginning. Bro, hey. what the fuck are you doing? Waiting for a burger. <laughs> Don't tell my family how I live. <laughs> um. Wow, that just completely threw me off of what I was saying. You were saying earlier this stream that. Oh, the, the history behind this game, a very large chunk of it being that. John Romero was so used to John Carmack being a goddamn cyber wizard and an actual, like, actually entering the Matrix with his brain that as soon as he had to make a game without that man, he suddenly was like, I don't know how to make video games anymore. Where the fuck is Superfly? I, I remember, uh, I remember Joe was actually telling me about that. He, he was like, yeah, weirdly... Weirdly, the the other guy who is not John Romero is always at like the forefront of the most promising new technology. <laughs> yeah, it, okay, one of the best ex like modern examples because I didn't realize this. Remember when like VR started to get like not amazing but it pretty good. Sick. When's the last time you saved? I think just a little bit ago. I hope. <laughs> I hope I really Yes, do. I do remember when VR started to pop off as a thing that consumers could buy. That was like a year after John Carmack started working on VR. I didn't say it recently. Authorized personnel only. Let's go! That's not the gun I wanted! It's the gun that you want. Da -da 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 -da. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Where's the gun that you want? Grease is terrible. You know what? Yeah. <laughs> it's like it's not really a hot take here. Grease, Grease does just, just kind of suck. Grease does <laughs> suck. Correct. I I mentioned it. Uh, I mentioned it on on stream, uh, or pre-stream. But uh, but Grease, Grease is. It's not a movie that I like per se, but it's a movie that I can get a lot of enjoyment out of because I don't know what the director told the extras, but every single character in Greece is doing way too much business in the background, literally always. I remember this rant the last time, the last time I played a game by John Romero that you joined me on. <laughs> Crazy how I, time is cyclical. Look, it's it's more uh, it's more that um, uh, how to how to put it when you give someone the exact same stimuli <laughs> enough times, they will respond the same way. <laughs> I can't believe that John Romero is the trigger that sets you off to talking about Greece. Yeah, I'm telling my dad about this since he's a psychologist. He can probably write a paper on it. We just oh, caused my... the psychological breakthrough of the century. Oh man, your your dad has a lot of brain poison of mine that he could work through. Pavlov, that was a greatly worded Pavlov sentence. Pavlov can suck my nuts. Now we're talking about Greece and John Romero. Get off me. Okay, I'm going back and getting more health. Pavlov, more like Pav Goblin, my nuts. <laughs> Thank you. Thank that you. That's very good. I'm very proud of Thank you. Thank you. This game was made by John Romero. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> just want to make sure you guys didn't think I made it. <laughs> uh, just so we're clear here, I'm not the villain. <laughs> <laughs> no one is the villain of this stream except for John Romero. Hey. 
So I will say, there is one recent thing that happened to me that I wanted to tell you about. Really, there was one? And... and there was one recent thing. Yes. Please, please, Veg. There was one thing that happened to you. And once again, I hate doing this because this is uh -huh. the third thing. Wait, no, 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 I already... Never mind. I already <laughs> told you about RR, didn't I? Um, I don't recognize it off oh. of the start of that thought. Okay, perfect. Um, so, uh, I need you to not watch the movie RRR. Um, okay. Because What's RRR? Uh, it's the greatest cinematic masterpiece I've ever seen in my life. And it's... you know I'll hate it? No, no, I'm doing a birthday stream in, you know, like six months where I'm going to force mm. as many people as possible to watch RRR for the first time. And possibly, I, I don't know what your reaction to it is going to be. Honest to God. I, I see. I, I can't wait. Uh, I'll tell you, I, I can probably guess what my reaction will be. It'll be to, uh, to piss take it, because that's what I do with literally everything. <laughs> that's it's, what uh, everyone else was trying to do at the beginning. So, I'll... I, I'm, I'm fucking dedicated. The only thing that I can't fucking... That I can't Mystery Science Theater 3000 is something that is truly boring. <laughs> just do also what am i what did you walk in on uh you walked in Black on john romero around. making us all his bitch i'm sorry uh planes walk a go go uh the b does not stand for bacon it stands for hold on let me spin my wheel booty what <laughs> that's not vegetarian. yeah brussels sprouts that's what i said <laughs> <laughs> I love how many, but, like, every once in a while, my username comes across someone, and they just immediately feel like fighting me and going like, uh, vegetarians. It's like, dude, buddy. I it's a gag. I, a it's goof. A gag. I eat so much fucking meat. Also, rude. Also, goddamn, I want a burger now. What? Also, it's not even your joke. Exactly. <laughs> it's mine. Fuck you. <laughs> Wait. Uh, oh, it's yours shit. now. Yeah. I stole it fair and square. Exactly. Look, sometimes you just steal your name wholesale from somewhere. I stole half my name wholesale from somewhere. Where from? Um, back when I was... So, just so we're clear here. Uh, so, I've been... Warped Lamp has been my brand since I was, like, 13. Um... And I decided that it would be my permanent brand, weirdly, while I was making my Spore account. Um, so, so I needed a, I needed a name to go with there, and I decided that uh, very nice. What the fuck was that? When's the last time you saved, champ? Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> um, and, uh, and I was 13, so I naturally, uh, liked machinimas, yeah. uh, as 13-year-olds do. And my favorite was, uh, was a Super Smash Brothers Melee machinima called Smash Tasm. It has aged like milk, don't look up, don't look into it. Um, but, uh, my favorite character in, in said machinima was, uh, was a character named Lamp. And I thought, that could be my brand. And uh, so I took that and I put and I put an adjective on it to make it my own. So warped lamp. I thought W words were pretty cool. And and now the guy who made that machinima and the guy who voiced lamp both follow me on Twitter. Cool. Not gonna lie, this rocket launcher is really satisfying. Th that's what obsessed me so much about this goddamn game. Is that every once in a while... Ask me to move. I... Please. Get out of... Superfly! Get... Uh, okay, we're fine. Every once in a while, this game gets fun for like half a second. Bit of a humble brag. Oh, no such thing. 
No, there's no, there's no humility here. I should leave. I should leave. Superfly! 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 Nice. Like, there's no point to try and brag without bragging, you know? Like, just do it. Accept that cool things happen to you sometimes, and expect that cool that other people will be enriched by you telling the stories about the cool things that happen to you. That's the most wholesome thing I think I've ever heard you say. Here's here's the here's the kicker for you, Veg. Uh, beneath this uh, beneath this facade of uh, of sarcasm and quick witticisms is uh, is someone who is extraordinarily sincere. Aww. Ah! Same, but with bad ass and dick jokes. Ah! Right. <laughs> No, I'm very much, uh, I'm very much of the stance, and I have been since, uh, since I was a teen who was trying to get over, uh, crippling issues of, uh, self-loathing, is that, uh, is that if you can pretend to be your number one fan, that's the same thing as being your own number one fan. You just do it long enough, and suddenly, suddenly everything's okay, and you just are able to believe in yourself. Huh. Neat. S some may say I've taken it too far and I'm now an egomaniac. They can eat their own asses. Also, Which is really cool of them. I love that they can do that. I know, right? You gotta be really flexible. Thank you, Clueless, for rating. Welcome to the future! Welcome to the world of tomorrow! The future? Okay, that's the worst part. This isn't even the future. This takes place in the 1400s, I think. Or something cool. like that. Have you ever listened to the full version of the Futurama theme? No, I haven't. It has a strange amount of of words in it. I'm not going to say lyrics, because that's not what it is. It has a bit more than is frankly welcome of, uh, of voice clips from Futurama in it. Because, like, in there it's got nice, it's got, a. Uh, it's got the guy saying welcome to the world of tomorrow. Yep. It's got it's got Fry going three, two, one, and Leela saying blast off. And then there's an extremely long, like like a uh, oh god, what would I even call it? Uh, an almost mariachi esque segment of Bender saying, I'm a bender, I bend girders. <laughs> Damn, hero okay. Just Oh shit, Superfly is dying. Uh Good. <laughs> what is this now? The fifth death on this level? Um, you know, let's not talk about that. Hi, gotcha. We're still on episode one. Of what? Of Dai Katana. Not good. No. No, that's not true. Uh, <laughs> Oh, okay. Just asked me to move. That's a funny bit, Veg. I like gaslighting too. I, I, I <laughs> just love how it's like. Yep. <laughs> Here it is. You like it? Deal. 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 Okay, let's talk about how you killed Superfly twice. Let's talk <laughs> about how we kill Superfly three times. Thrice. <laughs> I was gonna say. Um, he is not looking too good right now. Can you believe there's a Yu-Gi-Oh card that says thrice on it? Which Yu-Gi-Oh card? Uh, I'll go get it. Uh, I believe it's Mare Mare. Superfly. Yes, yeah, Superfly is the name of the actual character. He's ah, yeah, there it is. Mare Mare. You can reduce this card's level by one, and if you do special summon one mini Mare token, you can use the effect of Mare Mare up to thrice per turn. Just say three! No! <laughs> Ow. That was fine. That was cool. I meant to do that on purpose. This is fine. This is fine. Why can I suddenly not use this? Whatever. 
because you're John Romero's bitch. Damn it. Yeah, you should have thought of that. I should have. I should have considered that. That's okay. I hope I'll be able to fall asleep tonight. I wasn't able to last night. Oh, shit. Yeah. Uh, that's a problem that I was sort of glad that I had largely gotten over with the advent of melatonin. Uh, but uh, last night, no, I just didn't fall asleep. So I uh, but... fell asleep at 7 a.m. instead of the time I wanted to go to bed. And, like, let me be clear here, I was fucking exhausted at midnight. I wanted nothing more than to go to bed. But when I tried, it didn't happen. Life is pain. <laughs> As someone who also has very bad insomnia, understood. Okay. Nedge, please don't kill yourself. I am... Trying not to. What? The Just as like. Wow. <laughs> Amazing. Not only did you not take that advice, <laughs> you super not took it. <laughs> Fascinating stuff. I found this game's BFG. Please, just die. Now, Veg, I'll say again, you know, please don't kill yourself. <laughs> I am trying very hard. Veg, there's people who care about you. Like John Romero. I do not believe he cares about me. I do believe I am being gaslit right now. No. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> 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 All right, well, that's good enough for me. <laughs> I swear to God, if I go into this room and it says I can't leave without my buddy Superfly. What the fuck? Dude, you didn't even die. What are you what the fucking at? Come on. Stop Why being a do bitch. the rats have rocket launchers? Because this game rocks. That, yeah, that's a good point, actually. I'm gonna save. I don't know what a shock sphere. Oh, shock spheres are the. That's the thing that I blew myself up with. Nope. I mean, that's kind of underselling what happened to you, but yes. They're rat kit launchers. Rat kit launcher. I got, like, nudged. Yeah. Yeah. Love how the loading screen makes noise, by the way. Every oh, time. I despise that. And it yeah, it goes ting 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 ting. Just awful. Okay, so we're gonna save again, and I'm gonna try shooting a ball with them. This is going to work. It is a good idea. Get on the ball. Didn't even fire it. <laughs> Oops, stubs you toe die. <laughs> Krung. Bark. <laughs> Duchess is really mad at Dyke. Duchess is gonna unsubscribe. Did it Oh shit! Did it just not explode? Oh, nope, it worked. I'm gonna save again. Hey, Ben, you, you ever have a Shirley Temple? Yes. Yes, I love Shirley Temples, actually. I haven't had one in a while. I I saw how to... I saw the... I don't know if you... Uh, I don't know if you watch How to Drink on YouTube. That's a channel I like a lot. And he made a video about Shirley Temples. And uh, and in there, he, he mentioned something that, uh, that threw me off. Uh, do you know what goes into a Shirley Temple? Sprite and Grenadine. So, sometimes Sprite, or alternatively Ginger Ale. Yeah. I I did not know that there was that there was an alternative there. I thought it was always Ginger Ale. Sprite seems like a weird choice. That's always been Sprite as long as I've known. 
And he also said that there's uh, there's also a drink called like a Roy Rogers, which is, which is just a, a Shirley Temple, but yep. you make it with Coke. Yep. That sounds pretty good to me. It is. You can have like one a month. <laughs> Like, it's, they're sweet, but they're a kind of sweet that you can't handle very often, and you need to eat with a very specific kind of food. Where is Superfly? Carmen San Diego. No, I already played that game on stream. Hero, that was... come on. Hello! Yeah. We need to bust some more skulls. Oh my god, I really hope he doesn't die going through that room. Okay, you can hope for that. And you know what? It's good to have hopes and dreams. I know! What kind of you know, like Undertale. Like this. <laughs> John Romero does not like Undertale. <laughs> I can't tell if that's an actual fact or just a joke statement, but either way, I'm believing it. I, I mean, that can just become a part of your worldly philosophy. Sure, it was a joke. I mean, I can't imagine he'd like Undertale, right? He's kind of an edgelord. Yeah. He's kinda... Did you really escort Superfly and not save? Yeah. Man. What, are you stupid? Yeah. There we go. Hold on. I wonder. Can I get Superfly to use this? Oh, hey. Nope. Oh. I'm not going to be around soon if I don't get some help here. I would if I could, man. I'm literally. I'm literally pushing you to the thing that helps you. Like you like pushing me around? No. Go. That, that way. No. That way. There. No. Dangerous game you're playing. No. No. What if you break Superfly? It won't be the first time, nor will it be the last. Fine, I'll use up the rest of it. Tell you what, I, I really like, uh, I really like how to drink, cause like, cause like cocktails are pretty cool, but I don't, I don't like drinking. It's not, it's not for me. I haven't. Yeah. I haven't explored that that realm. I can't say I'm terribly interested in it. But I do I do like the sound of of cocktails. I like the sound of drinking cuz like it's like hey, you get to you get to mix shit and create like really unique flavor profile experiences. It's like I feel like there there exists the realm of non-alcoholic cocktails, but I feel like they they approach the wrong aspect of it where it's like it's trying to be a cocktail and not trying to be a Shirley Temple, which is a real non-alcoholic cocktail. Yeah. Make let there be more Shirley Temples. That's what I want. Please let him pick that up, please. Nope. Yes. Ooh. Yeah. Oh, I wanna. You, I wanna take a crack at making my own grenadine so I can make my own Shirley Temples. How do you make your own grenadine? It's it's pretty easy. I think you just need like pomegranate juice, like sugar and orange blossom water which is a strange ingredient but you don't use yeah. a lot of it in general you pretty much just use it for grenadine so <laughs> but you can absolutely make your own grenadine or you can just buy it but i don't want to do that yeah but well, uh, it doesn't last long enough and it without my buddy super can't leave without my buddy hey, super fly watch where you going Anything else in here? Huh? Anything else? Huh? Nope. Huh? Plan. Right, hero? Please let me up. Okay. Almost fell off. Whatever. It still counts. And now we can't hear the cutscene. Cool. Cool, baby. Strange, but not a stranger. Oh shit, I'm getting teal. Blue ball. Oh! Yo, listen up, here's the story. story. About the guy. Fuck, god damn it. And all day and all night and everything he sees is just a boy like him. Remember when that was like the song? Yeah. 
You remember that music video? With yeah. The, with the little blue alien the, the guys? One, the one that looked kind of like the Butt Ugly Martians TV show? Yeah. Yeah. Do you know that blue alien went solo? What? What do you mean, what? <laughs> <laughs> this isn't a bit. <laughs> Please tell me while I play the slippery game on a level called Ice Lab. Oh no. Oh no. Um, I don't know. I guess um, I guess Eiffel sixty five thought uh thought that their little blue alien guy was marketable. Where they were like, all right, let's try and create a whole little blue alien guy universe. And he got his own single, and it did not take off. <laughs> yeah. Also, and he got his own t nightmare animated music video, because of course he did. Also, yes, he does have a rat tail. Mm. I'm just gonna skip it. Please don't That's wise. Alright, I won't tell you that. Oh, thank you. Love how the best voice acting in this game, as far as I can tell, is the translated Japanese. Ow! That looked like a Mega Man villain. Mm. Or at least a Mega Man enemy. I like Mega Man. That's the machine that makes Mega Man's pretty cool. always full. I wish I was oh. playing Mega Man and not this. Oh, speaking of Mega Man, something I want to talk about. Uh, so instead of Mega Man, uh, you ever watch Survivor Man? I've never even heard of Survivor Man. Oh, uh, Survivor Man is, uh, it's an old survival TV show. Point of fact, I think it was, like, ground zero of, like, survival TV shows. Oh. Yeah, it was, uh, it was on Discovery, and, uh... And the guy, uh, the guy who, who ran it, Les Stroud, he's a he's a cool guy. And all of Survivor Man's available for free on YouTube. Go watch it. Um, but he's been putting out director's commentaries uh, on uh, on the episodes because you know he filmed all of them himself out in the middle of the fucking woods because he's just hardcore like that. And and uh, and he mentioned how important it is to have an editor who's not yourself, just oh. in general. <laughs> oh yeah. Cause like for one, it's just it's just a lot. But also, if you have an editor, you get to have creative collaboration, which is always important when you're making anything. Go on, Superfly. Walk into the no. Nope. Walk into the health pack. Into, no. There we go. Spits it out. Okay. Before I end this stream, I, I would like to do something very special. There is a discovery I made. Years hey, ago, Watch where you go. that I feel like you above all people will be able to appreciate. Mm. Because I know you're a f well, I'm 99% sure you're a fan of one of these things, and at least 60% sure you're a fan of the other thing that is involved in this. And it is a massive discovery that I've made that. Uh, I checked everywhere on the internet. No one has documented. Ooh. Well, I can't wait for that. Though, uh, real quick, someone uh, someone mentioned Bear Grylls in the uh, in the chat. Fun fact, uh, uh, Les Stroud, the Survivor Man, has no fondness for Bear Grylls. <laughs> None whatsoever. <laughs> Uh, because uh, Bear Grylls had this fun habit of uh, not showing you real survival tactics and just doing stuff that was good for the camera. Yeah, I remember all that. <laughs> oh, sir. Oh, it looks like it looks like he stuck his head in a beehive. He looks like a bear that was looking. He was going for too much. <laughs> Is this Winnie the Pooh's human Sona? Oh, father! <laughs> <laughs> you know Winnie the Pooh wants to say fuck. I can't leave without my buddy Superfly. Without my buddy Superfly. 
Why not? Dun, 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 dun. Okay, I'm going to try and get through one more level. And once that's done, I'm going to finish. And I'm going to show you, once again, something that... And here's the thing. I do ask that when I show this thing, no one else go around and say it. Simply because <laughs> I know that it will be good for internet content. But... Oh, God damn it! <laughs> <laughs> It'll be good for internet content, but, um, I don't know how to present it, if that makes sense. No. It's... You're trying really hard to, you're doing that thing that you do where you're trying to describe something without describing it, and you just can't. Yeah, I'm really bad at that. And that's the thing. <laughs> this thing is... Hard. And you're gonna keep trying. <laughs> I am. You can't stop me. Uh, also, I can. I can sure imply that I want you to stop. <laughs> so the person with me is my friend Lamp. Oh, I leveled up. Lamp, should I increase power, attack, speed, acro, or vitality? Um, vitality. All right. All right. <laughs> Let's see if that lets I'm... me go past a hundred. Glad we saw hey, that. It is. How far past a hundred is it? Oh. That's uh I really should have leveled this up from the start. Yes, 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 yes. I am not a smart boy. No, 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 no. <laughs> Don't you Jojo me. <laughs> uh, where am I going? I hate everything about this game. Hate. Let me tell you how much I hate. Don't do that. Why not? Should I do a different monologue about hatred? Um, do you have any Attention, idea? worthless human! This no, is your no, god speaking! No, 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 go back, go back, go to the, go to the fun one. <laughs> uh, here's a fun fact. Uh, <laughs> in order to, uh, in order to be become a part of uh, of the theater productions at uh, at our school, you had to you had to try and uh, you had to you had to audition in some capacity. Like the teacher just wanted to see what you could do: read a monologue, sing a song, do a dance, whatever. And uh, and I was like, sure, I'll read a monologue. And I was a and I was a, a card carrying homestuck at the time, so that's the one I did. <laughs> okay, have I told you about my high school drama teacher? Um, and no, but I bet I can assume, I, I can assume the sort. They were either nice or insane. Those are the only options. I really hope I saved recently. I bet you didn't. I bet I didn't. Um, dun, 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 so dun, they dun, fucking dun, dun. hated me. Like, they right. really, and, and to be fair, I was not the best student, and I was not the most attentive. But boy, right. they like, they consistently pushed that line that like a teacher shouldn't where it felt less like I'm upset because you're not listening and more like I genuinely dislike you as a person. And right. It, it was a little uncomfortable. And um he's in prison now. Ooh. Yeah. For um things found on his computer. And that's as much as I'll say. And I'm not gonna lie. Like, as horrible as all of this is, it was a little satisfying know that, knowing that the guy in high school who told me that I was never going to get anywhere in life, like, he specifically said to me that I was, and I quote, a horrible actor and would never go anywhere. Um, and that my future... I can't remember the exact wording. At the very least, though... He heavily implied that um, that you were a fuck up yeah, in like ways that and in ways that weren't correct. Like you are a fuck up, but like not because you're a bad actor. 
just because you make bad choices. Exactly. Uh, and yeah, it was just really nice to know that he went to prison for like an objectively bad thing. Yeah, no, it's it's nice to know that he had no moral high ground whatsoever. Exactly. <laughs> Alice in the chat. Oh, that teacher. I went to high school with him, so he knows. Yeah, that teacher. <laughs> I had to stop for a second and think because there was another teacher who also said the same thing to me, who uh, didn't go to prison, but he did go to jail for drunk driving. And it, um... Oh, God. So that was another thing that you happened. You save your game? Thank you. Um, <laughs> I figured out that's going to be my one redeem for channel points is reminding me to save the game. Right. I just haven't gotten a chance to do that yet. Um, what's in here? Ooh. Oh, I can't use that. Don't get too excited. This is still Daikatana. This is still Daikatana. Um, what you eating? Oh. Ah! What's he eating? Ooh, a TV dinner. Ooh, that looks like green. Be is that the lion from The Lion King? Uh, yeah. That's, um, that is an explosion from orbit. That's a pumpkin. And that's one of those ink plot drawings of my parents fighting. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, that's your way. But yeah, the oh, gotta save my game. Uh, <laughs> so <laughs> I just looked at her and saw the guy. Simba. <laughs> um. What was I gonna say? Uh. Oh yeah. So that other teacher. Um. There's just there were a lot of teachers who didn't like me, and um, especially after I graduated. So, I don't... Re what happened to me? Oh, fucking super... F <laughs> also, uh, yeah, I'm sorry. I just realized that uh, I forgot to take the uh, background out of Rocco. I'm going to be doing that right after the stream. And then hopefully re-uploading it quickly. Hopefully, please, Twitch. <laughs> okay. So, um, back when I was on the radio, there was a story that we talked about. I don't remember the context of it. Um, all I remember is it had something to do with, um, some sort of drama at a local school. Hero, come on. Like Let's some, some, skulls. some story happened and we, we both agreed. Yeah. Students are going to be talking about this like forever. Yeah. So we took calls on what was the drama when you were in high school. And, you know, we were going to field out any calls of anything that was bad. And we get a call from a student that was like, Yo, dude, did, did you go to Gross, Gross Catholic High School? And I was like, yeah, oh, no, 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 Superfly! There we go. It's like escorting a fucking duckling. <laughs> and, and he's like, okay, well, yesterday, one of the teachers got really mad at a student and choke slammed him into a locker. <laughs> <laughs> and we were like, what? And he was like, yeah, and no one's told the news about it. So we fucking jumped on this like, oh my God, we're the only ones who know. And in our state of excitement, we forgot that one of the number one rules of speaking about such things in radio God damn it, Superfly. Is you have to wait for Superfly. Is you have to, um... What happened to that guy? Anyways, uh, you have to beep out or censor any uh, locations, or right. businesses, etc. Sensitive information. Yeah. God damn it, Superfly! Oh, what, you wanted him on the lift? Yes, chokeslammed, like, like Undertaker style, into one of the lockers, um, and we uh, we forgot to censor the name of the school, or that I mm -hmm. was from there, and um, I'm not allowed back to the school anymore, as far as I know. 
That makes sense. Um, or at the very least, a lot of people got very angry at me. Um, and the student who called us, it was graduation day, and they didn't let him graduate. <laughs> They were just like, no, buddy. Sorry. You're... You you don't get to. No snitches. Yeah, no snitches. And then, in order to graduate, every student had to sign a gag order that they would not speak to any news organizations. Yeesh. Also, yeah, Renegade. Um, I, I don't think he was... I, I don't think he was a teacher that was... As far as I heard, it was a teacher that wasn't around when we were around. But yeah, some teacher choke slammed a student, and <laughs> I got a message from a friend that was like, "Dude, did you fucking talk about that on the radio?" And I was like, "Oh shit, yeah, I did." <laughs> oh no, I work in radio. <laughs> I'm a Mark. I did that. <laughs> that must be a terrible daily realization for you by the way <laughs> hey not anymore i'm not on the radio anymore it's great true that's definitely what i meant uh yeah it was um that sure was a school uh oh was i supposed to go that way who cares yeah who cares it's fucking dying. It's like, ow Tell you what, uh, tell you what my school drama that I remember was. I wasn't in any important social circles because, I mean, like, I figure you all have a pretty decent read on me as a person. I, social butterfly that I, I may be, I flourish on the internet and not in person. Yeah, same. Um, yeah. Except the um, conventions, obviously. <laughs> right. Um, it, it's just another performance. Um, but, be that as it may, um, so I wasn't in any major social circle, so I didn't have any juicy goss, but I remember that, uh, that, so there is, the, at our school, there was always Whoa! a senior, oh, nice, woo indeed, there was always a senior prank, and, uh, I, I don't even know what my class did, um, but I know what the class before my class did, their senior prank was, was they... They tore up a bunch of porno magazines and just scattered them through the halls. And that's not a good prank. Yeah. And that's also distributing pornography to minors. Oh, shit! <laughs> oh, no! Oh, shit! Oh, my God, I didn't even consider that. And to be fair, I'm guessing they didn't consider it either, but, like... I bet! <laughs> Uh, yeah, so, uh, that got, uh, that got the faculty annoyed. <laughs> Please, Superfly. Please, there we go. Um, so, the, the drama that I, hey, it, your girl. it's funny because I say I remember, but literally it's the one thing them. I didn't remember, um, because I wasn't there for it to happen, I was there for it the next day. Uh, mm -hmm. I showed up at school one day, and we... Like, a good half of my class, like, my year, was not there. And I never understood why until, like, a year later, when someone said, Hey, remember the barn orgy? <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, excuse me, the what? Yeah, you know, when they burnt down that barn? What? <laughs> I was like, no, no, I don't, because I wasn't popular, so people didn't tell me things. Yeah. I wasn't invited to the barn orgy. <laughs> I wasn't invited to the barn orgy. Yeah. But would you have Would you have shown up if they did? I don't know, and I don't want to think about that. <laughs> yeah. So apparently, we did a real good at football, and they went to because you know we're in the Midwest. So you do as you do. Oh yeah, the worst part is you have to ask which barn orgy. It's specifically the one where they burnt down the barn, and so every kid was afraid to go to school the next day because they burnt down a fucking barn. Oh shit. But yeah, I didn't know what happened. I just knew that no one showed up to class that day. 
and like a bunch of my classes just got canceled. <laughs> Did you see the pool? They flipped the bitch. <laughs> This has to be close to the end, right? It doesn't have to be anything, Badge. I can't leave without my buddy Superfly. I'm so loyal to my buddy Superfly. I would die for my buddy Superfly. I spread my cheeks only for Superfly. I, you say as I'm saving my girlfriend? Well, like, I know how this oh. game shakes out. Oh... John Romero is gonna make you his bitch. <laughs> John Romero. <laughs> this letter comes from John Romero. He says, <laughs> "Screw you." <laughs> this letter is from Jay Romero. He asks, "My other John buddy no longer wishes to be friends with me." How do I get my friend and computer wizard back? From your bitch, maker. <laughs> what, so fun Homestuck fact a day or two ago, the surprise run Discord was talking about how they found SR and a, peep, a bunch of people found it through Jello, of course. I must confess, I had literally never heard of Jello in my entire life before my partner showed me Epithet Erased. Er, ep, epithet, ep, epithet? Epithet Erased as it was airing, but boy, as someone who was a Homestuck back in the day, I could <laughs> I could sure immediately recognize the names Warped Lamp and Veggie BLT on sight. I love that because I didn't do jack fucking shit. You're, you were around. You were like I like, was. I was the goddamn parasite. I didn't do a damn thing myself. No, no, no. You know what you were? You were like the Agent Coulson to the multiverse that was. The, the I, fandom. You just appeared in every major event in the background and went, "Huh? Well, okay," and then you left. <laughs> Um, there was, there was someone, <laughs> there was someone who compared me to, I think the character, the character's name is Michael in the Scott Pilgrim movie, where, uh, where Scott walks up to him and he's like, it's like, do you know a girl with hair like this? Yeah, it's Ramona Flowers. Yeah. <laughs> like, I, <laughs> I, I was, I was the guy who knew everyone because I, <laughs> it's what I did. <laughs> Okay, I'm ending this here. I may come back to it eventually. I don't want to. That's a that's a that's a very funny story, Bo. I'm surprised you hadn't mentioned that before. <laughs> okay, now we're just gonna quickly. Okay, I... what are we gonna what are we quickly gonna do, Badge? Okay, I need to go to. Because I think I have it on my watch later. We're going to watch uh -huh. something together. Are we? And I am going to... Where is it? Where is it? I just saw it earlier. Because I had saved yeah, it. Where the, where the fuck is it? Trust me. Thing. This is... Story of a girl. Every time I say this is, that immediately starts going in my head. Just I need a moment. Isn't that ironic? I, you know what? I, honest to God, cannot remember, like, anything in that song after, isn't it ironic? And then the song just stops for me. See, for me, my brain goes to, isn't it ironic? Isn't it I-R-O-N-I-C-I-R, I-R-O-N-I-R-C, yeah. A water park is burned to the down and a... And a okay. fucking tow truck is broken down. I always used to cry when I laugh. And then I will not finish that line. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it was, it was earlier than this. I, where did I put it? I was into Homestuck back in the day, but what specifically did Veg do that was tied to Homestuck? An excellent question. <laughs> men, men, there, there were... <laughs> Many. There are memories best left forgotten. <laughs> Ah, oh, Vad, you're ashamed of our shared history all of a sudden? Not the, not the you part. The me part. Yeah, I'm fucking great, bro. Yeah, hell yeah, you are. <laughs> Here it is! Yes, I found it! Okay. 
No, God damn it! Look away from the screen. Look away from the screen, lamp. Look away from the screen. Okay, fine. I'll look away from the screen. What are you doing? Uh, again... Fucking! Oh my God! YouTube is crashing. <laughs> I broke YouTube. Okay. Okay. All right. Everyone, we're gonna watch this video together. Can and... Can the screen see? Did yes. you Did you yes. remember to switch? Yes, the... Okay. 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 Oh, that's very loud. What happened to you? It's weird newscasters. I, 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 I assume you like whose line is it anyway. Of course I do. And then we skip ahead a little bit. And... Okay. This bit. So, uh, just so you know, champ, I can't hear it. Doesn't matter. You need to tell me... <laughs> mm -hmm. Hold on. Let me actually... Let me make it so you can't hear it. I don't know if I can do that. Hold on. Let me... Uh, let me... Uh, uh, it, don't don't worry. Don't. It, it doesn't matter if you can hear it. Mm -hmm. What matters is if you recognize the faces. Some faces are about to pop up that no one else on the internet has pointed out. Do you recognize that face? I don't know. I'm just going to let it keep going until someone in chat recognizes those three people. Because I have never seen anyone, and I have dug and dug and dug, and no one has pointed this out. Does anyone recognize them? Hmm. Can't say I do. All right, let me go back to the face. Let me go back to. Yeah, go back to the face, bud. Let me. Nope. Those are the whitest kids you know. Oh. Like the sketch group. Oh, I suppose they are. <laughs> All of them but Timmy. It's weird that you that you bring this up, actually. YouTube's been recommending me Whitest Kids You Know sketches that I've already seen 12 years ago. <laughs> but yeah, huh. on top of that, at this point, they break the green screen. <laughs> <laughs> he actually climbs up and he tears the green screen. <laughs> the Whitest Kids You Know got on whose line is it anyways? And broke the green screen. <laughs> Who? Ah, uh, yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> like, don't worry about it. This is this is why I'm having so much trouble with figuring out how to word this. Because one, the lead dude died the day I had the post ready to go, and I was like, "Oh, now is not the time for that." And two. It's just so hard to work. Like, do I make it in video format? But that's just talking over that. Do I make it a tweet? I mean, probably, right? You just tweet the screenshot and go, go shouts to that time. The whitest kids, you know, were on fucking whatever and broke the green screen. But it's more so the fact that this is completely undocumented on the entire then, internet. Then just... Then just tack on a, and no one cared. <laughs> <laughs> I care! I care so much! I've discovered one thing, and I discovered this! this Your ancestors are really proud of you, like, oh, wow, that wasn't oil or fire. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I think with that, I'm gonna say goodnight. Goodnight, everybody. Goodnight, Lamb. <laughs> Goodbye, chat! <laughs> <laughs>